This is room 725 in the Intercontinental at the wharf. So there's the closet to the left when you first walk in the door. It has that big giant mirror and this sliding door. It's a light. Map of DC. It's kind of cool. It's actually very cool. Um, there's this. Hopefully we can use as a fridge, but they charge you if you use any of this stuff. Anyway, um, here's the room. We got this with points, so we did not have um, the ability to choose our view, which... I thought we might have a view, not the a view of the water. However, I didn't think that we would have a view. And this is a light, and there's a desk chair. There's two nice chairs here. It's a nice size room. The king size bed. There's drawers there. Um, but anyway, the view is a little disappointing. I thought we'd at least have a view of the city or um, the water, but we have a view of this courtyard and there's office building there. So this is not the greatest view, this is room 725. If we were to come back, I think we would try to get a different view. Um, Again, we used points, so we weren't able to pick one of the rooms where you can pick rooms that will tell you what view you have. Anyway, so this is a room from back here. Again, it's a nice size room. It's a very nice hotel. Just not very happy with the view. Here's the bathroom. They have rooms that have really Fancy tubs, but again, we couldn't get those because of the, oh, there is a tub in here. That's nice, it's not, well, it's a decent sized tub. Actually, that's kind of nice. I might take a bath there. The shower, the toilet, it's a nice, big, beautiful bathroom. Supposed to be robes somewhere. I would have brought my robe. I haven't seen that. Maybe because of COVID. They don't... <laughs>